Okay, and this time we need to find the present value. They're asking me how much do I need to in the to deposit now, which is they're asking for the present value. In order to have five thousand, that's the given value in the future. So now we just do the same thing as the one I just showed you before. And uh start all over here. <coughs> Financial. And we're trying to find the present value. So we look in PV present value because that's what we're trying to find. All right. Um, present value. All right. And the rate was 8%. So remember, because it's compounded monthly, we have to go 0 0.08 divided by 12. Okay. And the periods, since it's compounded monthly, it's going to be five years. So five times 12 because there's five years and it's compounded monthly. So the periods are. 5 times 12. And now we have a choice. Either I put payment or future value, depending on <coughs> what information is given. They did not give any kind of payment information, but they did give us a future value information, which is 5,000, in order to have 5,000 in five years. So I put the 5,000 here. I leave the payment blank. I have no idea what type is. I've never used it. So don't don't, don't, don't care. So there. So I need to deposit $3,356.05 today with these things in order to have 5000 in my account in five years.